In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to update the WooZone plugin, or WZone as it's otherwise known. Now it's really important to keep this plugin up to date so that it's always in line with the latest changes at Amazon. And also because AA team are always adding some new features. The most recent one being the ability to import products without the need for some API keys. I did a video on that just the other day. Be sure to go check it out by clicking on the link that appears up there somewhere. Now generally you update the plugin just by clicking the update link that appears within the plugin section. However, for some people that has not been working, so I'll show you how you can update it manually as well. So let's get on the computer, let's get this done. So I'm over at this fantastic website, it's robinhoodcookware.com, site created by one of my viewers, a regular in fact, R7 Eagle, you might have seen him on one of the live streams, he's always in the chat. And yeah, he's got this lovely website all about cookware, and it's running WooZone, and it's not updating, so let's go and have a look what's going on. You might be having the same problem as well, when you go into installed plugins, you take a look at, uh, WooZone or WZone as it's now known. It says there is an update available, but when you click update now, it says the update has failed, a valid URL was not provided. So if this happens to you, what you need to do is install it manually, which is actually pretty easy. So what we're gonna do is deactivate uh, WooZone, and I'm gonna delete it. Now don't worry, you're not gonna lose any settings or anything like that. That's gone. Then over on Code Canyon, you wanna go into your downloads area and take a look in there and find your WooZone download link. Mine's here. I'm gonna download all files and documentation. Just download it to uh, my downloads folder. That'll be a good place. So I've already got it, but never mind. I'll download it again. You then wanna extract the zip file that you just downloaded. So here it is, just gonna double click on it. It's extracted a folder called 12.3b, which is the latest version of WooZone. Your number might be different. Could be a higher number if you're on a later version. So once you've extracted it, go back to the website. Here we go. Then I'm gonna go add new and basically just install the plugin like any other plugin. So upload plugins, choose file, find that folder in the downloads area, 12.3b. And within there, there's a folder called plugin and then it's woozone.zip. Select that and then press open. Then install now. Then activate. So there we go, running 12.3b. You can see there's still loads of settings and performance and all that kind of stuff is in there. So it hasn't lost any settings. It's all good. We're all done. We're up to date. Easy as that. That brings us to the end of this video. Hope you've got your woozone all up to date. If you've got any questions or comments, then please leave them below. I do read all of the comments I get and I'll try and reply to as many as I possibly can. There's a couple of videos that have appeared, they've been chosen especially for you. You can subscribe by clicking on the eagle and if you wanna check out my vlog channel, click on my face. Until next time, bye for now.